what is up you guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm bringing to you guys um a makeup tutorial it's so it feels so good to get back in like to, and to like this type of content because i haven't done this type of content in such a long time um so today I'm gonna actually be reviewing a makeup brand that reached out to me. And yes, she is black owned, black and Haitian owned at that. So um, yeah, so we're gonna be reviewing, this is gonna be an honest review because this is the first time that I'm trying these products. Um, everything looks so good. Um, just basic, you know, basic products, nothing, um, just all the basic things that i like all the basic things that i wear um she sent them to me so that i can so that i can review for her so what i'm gonna do is because i don't think i have that much storage oh and i'm also gonna try to make this i'm also gonna try to do this video in creole and english as well so um my fair makeup tutorial. So long time taking fair, we've been stop fair. We're gonna move on. 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 We're so my preview your makeup um pour dire ça c'est yon dame qui c'est en haïtienne li how do i say that sometimes i get i fumble like with the word so m da comme dit comme ça oui m capable review makeup yo pour li um et puis tout bagage ressemble yo you know belle uh mais celle ça mon petit jean père c'est foundation non pas quoi li couleur I don't think the foundation is my color. Um, we're gonna have to, okay, we'll see. I'll still review it, so we'll see what we'll do. So let me start with put them up. So while I'm while I'm um, putting doing the makeup, that's when I'll like review each pro, each individual product. So let's start with let's start with my brows. Okay, so. Pour montrer nous ça avant, so lire les Tamara, uh, Tamara Cosmetic. Her name, the name of the brand is Tamara Tamara Cosmetics. Um, I hope y'all can see that Tamara Cosmetic, and I'll have everything linked in the description box if y'all are interested in checking her out. So this is a little Sasayon eyeshadow palette. This is an eyeshadow palette, and it has a mirror. And I love that because I can I get to see myself while I'm, you know, putting on the makeup. So this is the first product, and I love this. I love these colors. However, I probably won't be using any of these today. Um, maybe I'll use this one and this one. So they don't have names on them, but I guess you can kind of see what color what colors they are, you know, just by opening it up. So we're gonna start with brows. Now, come and avec Susi. So the brow gel, it's called Tinted Eyebrow Pomade. So say on pomade pour Susi. Um, it comes in this little box and this is it right here. The shade is not listed, but I mean, obviously, you can tell that it's brown. So, living avec un petit bois tout, avec un petit um, applicator pour pour qu'à mettre pour mettre la sous sous sous. All right, so we're gonna start. It comes with this little applicator and uh, along with a little brush. So we're gonna start with. Oh, she also sent me this, so I'm gonna use this one instead. Yeah. Ma petit lise ça plutôt, li voye ça bon tout. So, ma commence avec ça. Um, it's very 
li facile pour ka mettre li pa di li pa trop mou um trop de l'eau li pa trop de l'eau it's not too like liquidy um it's like a pasty consistency so if y'all can see see that okay so when i dip it in there it's like very tasty like i used to be into the like really heavy dark brow type of look but we're past that now um hmm Okay, so it dries on kind of ashy, kind of. Hmm. So this is how it dries on. Hmm. I'm not sure if it's going to stay that way or I think I could darken it up a little bit because I have some black. So honestly, this is just to show y'all how, um, how all the products are. The finished look, I may have to tweak a little bit um, some stuff because obviously, as you can see, it dries on very gray. Um, but like I said, y'all see before how it looks and the after is gonna be like, you know, what I had to fix or anything like that. So like I said, this is gonna be an honest review. You know what I think? I think that this is not my shade. I think the eyebrow um, tint, what is it, the pomade? I think it's just not my shade. Because I, I don't know. Yeah, it's probably just not my shade. And also, I can't really judge based off of these products that she sent to me because I didn't get to, because I didn't get to um, see them in person before she, she just kind of, I sent her a picture and she just kind of went, you know, based off of what the picture looked like, um, you know, to try to match my foundation and stuff like that. So, so yeah. That's how that went, but so this is the concealer. Once again, it's not really my shade. Well, it's a few shades lighter than me, so it's probably gonna be way too bright on my under my um, eye. But let's see how it applies. So yeah, well, I can work with that. I could work with that. Okay. So Moving on to the foundation. Actually, she didn't send me a primer, so I'm gonna have to use my primer. At least I don't see a primer. Okay, so I have to use my primer. Um, and this is the e.l.f. 
primer that I'm using, just for reference. And already I can see that it's a little, it's a little too dark for me. Okay, I get on where? Okay, don't mind my brows, y'all. I'm gonna fix it. Um, okay, I get on where? Okay, foundation now. I'll see your P. Marron, P. P. Foncé. Okay, moment. So we'll see. Let's still try it. Um, I'm still gonna try it. And it has this um pump. Comes with the pump. I'm trying to show y'all, but the pump is not pumping. Okay, so the pump isn't working. Um, but let me go ahead. Yeah, this is way too brown. I can't. No, I can't. No. Mm -mm. That's not going to work. That is not going to work. Let me go wet my beauty blender. Yeah, it's way too brown. It's way too brown for me. But um, I can say, although it's um, way too brown, I can say that it is... It's a nice consistency and it's actually full coverage. It's full coverage. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually still do a look, <laughs> even though I'm gonna look crazy, I'm gonna still do a look with this and let y'all know how it turned out like. Yeah, it's way too brown, I look crazy. I look crazy. But those little like dots that I did, they actually filled my entire face. Wow. So definitely I can already see a little goes a long way. Yeah, I look like I have a tan. So a little goes a long way. I think this could still work, let's see. A little bit, because this is way too bright. The concealer is a little chalky um it's a little chalky gosh i think i put too much um let's see so it dries on let's see All right, so because these products don't match my, you know, my skin color, I've decided that I'm just gonna judge them based off of, or review them based off of, you know, their consistency, the formula, um, how well they apply and how long they stay on. So don't look at how, it, how I look in it. Actually, it don't look too bad. On camera, it don't look too bad, but looking in this mirror, you know anyway so yeah i'm gonna judge based off of those you know four things that i just said um so stay tuned for uh, that after the video all right so she has these oh i was trying not to do that so she has these two uh compact powders matte finish compact powders so this one is in hot chocolate um, 09 and this one is deep tan 07. So I am going to use, judging by these, I'm gonna use this one because this one is darker. And let's see if it warms up 
under my eyes just a little bit. Mmm. So. Okay. I like that. I love me a good blotting powder. Compact powder. Okay, so from the products that I have, I can't really do much of a like a like a beat only because there's not like that many products to choose from for like a beat, but oops, sorry. I just want y'all to see like Can y'all see? The products, um, if I'm judging the products, they are great products and everything seems to be matte. My face looks very clean, very airbrushed. I don't know if it's picking it up on the camera. Um, if everything, okay, I love these products. I'm not kidding you. Now that I'm looking at my face after um, after applying everything, okay, let me be honest. Pardon, pardon, let me premier. The only thing that I'm not too, you know, fond of is the brow, the what is it called, brow tint, the brow pomade because it's a little bit ashy for me. Um, like I said, maybe it's not my shade, but everything else i think the product the actual product itself is amazing because i'm a matte girl i like let me tell you i like my face to be not dry and ashy looking but i don't like to have like that dewy oily looking like look okay so for me it's giving like that's what it's given these products that's what they're giving matte very clean very airbrushed let me see if i can show y'all better like can y'all see that it looks like skin like it's something like for this poem that's what it looks like, you know. Um, um, it's very everything is very lightweight. Um, I guess it depends on how you apply it as well. So I'm going to I was gonna put a little bit of this. Let me put a little bit of this color on my let me show this this color. Put a little bit right here. I used to do that this a lot. Um, huh. Tap it in a little bit more. I used to do this a lot on the bridge of my nose, right here. But yeah, I love these products overall. I think I messed up by doing that. <laughs> by doing that just a little bit. Yeah, so like I said, if we're judging based off of the product itself, yeah, these products are amazing. I guess this is like the finished look because like I said, everything is very lightweight and um, I'm actually gonna put some lipsticks. These two, so these are lip pencils. This one is in um, the shade 10. Number 10 is, and this one is number 13. So the lighter one is 10 and the darker one is 13. All right. All right. 13, 13, 10. All right. So I'm going to use, since she sent me over some lipsticks and a lip gloss. So this is her lip gloss. Um, it's in the shade number 33. All right, so this is the lip gloss, it's brown. These are the pencils. Um, and this is one of the lipsticks that also, and it says her name on it. This lipstick also came with a pencil. 
um, a lip pen and it's in the shade 18. So these both are 18, the shade 18. So number 18. So, and this lipstick here is number nine. Um, and it looks like this. It's very, very bright. It's showing brighter on camera. It's not that bright in person. But I'm not a red lipstick girl, so I'm not going to try this one. However, I may be trying this one because it looks a little... We'll see. So what I'm going to do is... Let me put my hair back. I'm going to line my lips with this one. This is number 13, okay? Line my lips. Actually, I think I should be lining my lips with a darker thing. All right, you guys, this is the finished look. This is what I managed to get um, with the products that were sent to me. I will be doing another review with different products that she will send. She will send other products. Um, uh, I do have to let her know that the foundation is not my shade, which although it looks good on camera, when I look in that mirror, it looks completely crazy. Um, but yeah, the only thing that I have um, to say, I don't have any cons um, based off of, like I said, the products, the products themselves. Um, but when it comes to like my shade, these, some of these weren't my shades and I tried to work with them as best I could. Um, but the products themselves are great. I must say that the foundation, that foundation though is full coverage. The, um, the eyebrow pomade, like I said, it's a little ashy once again maybe because it's not for my shade maybe it's for someone lighter than me um someone lighter than me could use it and it would look probably nice you know on them um the concealer the concealer was way too bright for me but i managed to but i managed to make it work um as you can see as well as the blotting powders they were amazing so my two favorites were the foundation although it wasn't my color the foundation it's great and the powders so the foundation and the powder so i used deep i used uh chocolate hot chocolate 09 so this is the one that i used and these the formulas is the formulas in these are amazing i must say so yes if y'all if anyone is interested in shopping uh tamara cosmetics i will have everything linked in the description bar down below shop na tamara cosmetic map mete tout bagay Toute information en bas vidéo a pour nous cliquer pour nous voir Instagram li pour nous voir tout réseau social réseau social please be sure to like comment and subscribe make sure to subscribe abonné 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 mon haïtien abonné ensemble avec um ensemble avec channel moi and i will see y'all in my next video bye